How's it going YouTube? So today we're unboxing Smart Grill. Smart wireless barbecue thermometer color coded probes. As you can see it has a nice uh, orange backlit which I think is pretty cool looking. And of course it works for Android and iPhones. And the search for the software is digital BBQ. And this one here says therm uh, meat therm thermometer for grill wireless meat thermometer. Uh, so let's see, do we have a branding on this? Uh, uh, permanently free app, easy to use, temperature ranges. And this we use uh, two double A's. Oh, I didn't bring batteries with me. Uh, 200 hours, LCD, and app display probes supports up to six probes two in standard package oh <laughs> it only came with two i could have sworn in the photo it actually it showed six i was assuming i would get all six but that's okay all right so to unbox this is pretty easy you just have to just push it through it came like this and it's already just dusty <laughs> okay unbox it put that in there and open it up. Oh, it does come with batteries. Awesome. 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 Okay, so here's the unit itself. As you can tell, it looks just like the cover. Oh, I guess the branding is just called Smart. As you can see, here's the temperatures right here in Celsius and Fahrenheit. Actually gives you little uh, indications of you know temperatures for poultry, uh, for ground meats, beef, pork, pork, lamb, veal, seafood, and at the end it's ham fully cooked to reheat holding temperature. Cooking. So here's the, all the uh, probes. You we'll stick it here on the sides according to the numbers. It has a nice little simple stand here. If I can pull it out. There you go. And power buttons on top. It's a nice little peel stick here. Let's pull it in. Oh, that does not feel right. Look at that. I'm just yank the whole display cover off. You know what? I'm just gonna leave that there. I'm not. <laughs> well, I feel like I'm yanking out this whole thing here, and I'm sure there's a little thin plastic on top, but. Those the sticker just yanking off the whole thing. So guess what? That's gonna stay there. And well, that's it. So here's our the prongs for the thermometer. Put that right here. I'm gonna go ahead and pop open the batteries real quick. So we can see if it actually does light up orange. I'm pretty sure in the description online on Amazon it did list it. And I'll, I'll make sure to include the affiliate affiliate link below in the description. So if you like this, you can get one for yourself. Help support the channel. There's a little small cut of like 10 cents probably comes to me. <laughs> All right, so batteries in. And usually like, yeah, I like to have the lab main label facing up. Close. All right. Look at that. So, the power, you can see the orange lit. I'll turn it dim down the light. See? Nice little orange. It's not as bright and vivid as I, I thought, but it's more than enough. Okay. Oh, wow. It has nice. Wow, this is very nice. It's like a little cardboard glued to the foam. Let's touch. Here's the manual. <clears throat> Pretty much what I explained. If you want to pause it, you could pause it. Leash has it on there. Here's wire probes. Wrap. Enjoy the barbecue. Here's the kind of like the app interface. Monitor. Silicone go uh, handle goes up to 250. Make sure you kind of monitor that. Here, if you want to take a picture to download the app, that would take you straight to it. And here's the pairing process. 
Then, here's the pros. Look at that. Pretty nice. So, let's see what we have here. One, two, three, four probes. Okay, well, I could have a red two. Supports up to six. Two in standard package. So, maybe this is a premium package. So, I got four. Four cool probes. Very nicely made. You can see the kind of like the, the mesh uh, wiring. That's nice. Yeah, let's take one out just for you. So you can kind of see here. Has a nice little bead here. Stick the probe into the meat. I like the way they you can store this. That's, that's a very nice uh, storing package. Simple, but it's effective. Almost like an earphone, just plug it into the barbecue thing. See? Well, let's plug it in and see. It gives us a little notification of something. There you go. I don't use Celsius, and I doubt I could change it here. Yeah. I can't change it here. I guess I'll have to use it, use the app to change it. But I believe you, you know, you times it by three and subtract maybe like three or so. So, you know, it's about 80 something degrees then is what it's currently capturing. Anyways, that's pretty cool, right? I don't really cook uh, barbecues too much, but it's always nice to have one just in case you do. Because, you know, I got kids, so, you know, you always have to kind of walk away and you might set and forget type of thing situation. So, I always got one just in case. Should the situation come around, I would have it set, ready to go. So we have four probes, but comes with um, comes with two clamps. <laughs> Shouldn't it be four? But that's not a big deal. You just stick in the meat, and you just stay there. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take off the batteries. Cause this thing doesn't really seem to turn off. Oh, well, there you go. Turned off. I mean, normally for long-term storage, you shouldn't leave batteries in. So I'm just going to go ahead and take it out anyways. Let's shove it right here. I'll shove it like right there. Okay. Well, let's put the cover back on. Well, as you can see, this is a pretty simple device. You know, not much to it. I'm sure there's more options in the app itself. You know, setting alarms, timers, uh, cooler looking displays but I'm qu quite happy with this I think it the device itself would provide more than enough information depending on the probe you can come check each probe it doesn't really tell you how to navigate each probe I'm assuming if you have two it'll just you know show one in a blink for you know 10 seconds and then switch to the next one blink and it'll switch back and forth between the probes and of course there's a little chime and when it's ready it'll give you a little notification and that's about it. So if you have any questions or if you actually want to see me use this, I can always, you know, make a video of me, you know, grilling some steaks or something. I don't know. But like I said, leave your comments below. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And this has all the certifications, which is really good. Um, yeah. And I'll see you on the next one.